What are you doing? Are you a happy dog? You've got dirt all over my feet now. Dirt all over my feet. Let's take a look at this. I don't know if you guys can see this lump that is coming out. It feels like a golf ball when you grab it. What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm here with my beautiful girl Finn. It's actually my sister's dog. What are you so happy about? You so happy? We just finished the last video. If you guys saw it, you would know that we were setting up that turtle tank that's in the back there. And when I let the dogs out in the end, checking them out, I saw this big lump on the side of Finn here. And I don't know if you guys can see it, right where that dark area is, right there. I guess I'm gonna give her a bath right now so you guys can see it a little bit better. But let me call my dad first and see what he thinks could be the problem. That is a better angle right there of the lump. I know she has this curly hair, so it's kind of hard to see, but that lump right there is hard. I can literally grab whatever it is, but I don't want to grab it too hard because I don't know what it is. So it seems my dad isn't answering. I've called him twice. I've texted him a picture and a little bit of information about the problem. Finn, are we going to be okay? Are you going to be okay? She seems to be acting totally fine as if nothing's wrong but if it is some sort of growth we're gonna have to get it off it uh, my guess is it's a cyst now it is kind of big if my sister was petting her or I was petting her I feel like we would have noticed it before but hopefully we're getting this in time before it gets any bigger don't know if this could be cancerous she is a puppy she's not very old so that would not make any sense it's very dark there but I'm gonna wait for my dad to call. Let's give her a bath right now just to see how big this lump is because with all that hair that's dry and fluffed out in the way, it's hard to see. It's bath time, it's bath time. Can you sit for me? Good girl, you are just such a good girl. I'm gonna be using some of my product line shampoo, Live Positively. If you guys wanna check out the website, the link is down below. This is gonna be hard to do with one hand. You're not supposed to drink the water, you're supposed to bathe in it. Are you really thirsty? Come on. So now that I've washed her off a little bit, you guys can see over the top just where that lump is. The hair is laid down a little bit and you can see, look, 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 stop, stop licking yourself. You can see if I go like this, let's see, where's that lump? Right there. If I go like this, it's catching that lump. It's literally in my hands here. It feels crazy. I really hope you're gonna be okay. Well, let's finish giving her a bath just so she's cleaned up. Just working some of that natural shampoo and now trying to be gentle with that side. I don't wanna mess with it too much. Are you being a good girl? And would you look at that? She is all dry now. She's got her fresh bath because you were a little stinky. You were a little stinky. So now what I'm going to do is go to my dad's veterinary office. Unfortunately, I cannot film in there. I'm going to bring her with me and see what the problem is. I will be back with you guys when we get back. Guys, so it has been a couple of days and Finn is still at the vet, but she's doing a lot better. As we're waiting, I thought I would show you what we found just in the backyard this morning. This guy is a beautiful mud snake. Now I think I've shown some of these on the channel before. You can see that brilliant pattern on their belly. And these guys are native to Florida. We found him just in the lake in the backyard. And he's completely harmless to me. He wants nothing to do with me, no problems, and he's being super calm. Are you gonna, gonna try to go into my eyeball there? This guy is so beautiful. I think we might keep him here with us for a little bit. They eat all sorts of amphibians, but mainly amphiuma, which look like this. We actually caught a couple of them. I call them eels, but they're not eels exactly. They're actually a salamander that's native to Florida here. They love those things. Maybe if we are to catch one, we'll show feeding this guy a big amphiuma, which is sometimes as long as he is almost. Oh, you're falling there, buddy. We're trying to get some support on you. I don't know what's going on. He's going to be going up into my hoodie now. 
So anyway, guys, as he... He's crawling up into my hoodie. Okay. I think we're good. Just a gorgeous snake. That brilliant red on him is absolutely stunning. He's going to keep hanging out. If you want to comment down below, a little name for him. Comment down below. You got that red pattern there. That might give you an idea for some names. But guys, Finn is doing much... Well... Finn is doing much better and she's about to come here now, so let's wait for her and see when she gets here. My sister just got here with Finn. Let's see. She, my sister didn't want to be on camera, so let's let her out. Come on. Oh my gosh, Finn. Where are you going? Where are you going? Hi. Oh, let's see how you're doing. She's so happy, guys. Look at her. She looks bigger. Did you get bigger? Did you grow? I don't know how much you weigh now. You look like a monster. She's growing so big every day. Let's see here. Where's that lump? I can't even feel anything anymore. I can't even feel anything anymore. Oh, there's a little bit there still. And still kind of feel something a little bit there. She's like, what are you feeling me for? It's basically gone. It's basically gone. Tail's wagging, face is happy. So guys, let me explain to you what happened. Finn was in a little altercation. Actually, it was pretty bad. My sister was taking her for a walk and she actually got bit by two random dogs. And we tried looking to see if everything was fine, but maybe a slight puncture got in there and it got infected is what we're thinking. So Finn has been on this antibiotic. The dogs we ended up finding the owners for in the neighborhood that fought with Finn Thank God they didn't get hit by any cars while they were loose, and thank God Finn is okay. So, she's been on this antibiotic, and now it looks like she's feeling a lot better. It looks like you're feeling a lot better. She said, can I have some more of that antibiotics? That stuff made me feel very, very good. Let's go see the other dogs. Look at that. Are you guys reunited with each other? They're going crazy. Oh, oh, oh. They're excited to see me, they're excited to see Finn. What are you guys doing? You can see they've absolutely destroyed the wall. They destroyed it over there as well. We had to fix it with a minor little patch there, but they're always up to something. Oh, Maverick. Oh, Maverick, you're a good kid. Mwah. Maverick's just happy that Finn is back. Finn is playing over there with Piper, as you can see. Guys, if you want to see all of these crazy dogs, more of that stuff, then subscribe to the channel. Check out when Maverick was a puppy and we first got him, when Piper was a puppy, and we first got her, when Finn was a puppy, and she was playing with the Black Jaguar. There's crazy videos on this channel. Maverick is giving me some love right now. Maverick, can you, can you calm down for one second? We're on camera. We're on camera, dude. Guys, if you enjoyed this video, thank you so much. I'm sorry that you had to go through that with me, but Finn is feeling much better now, and that's all that matters. So I will see you guys in the next adventure. Like this video if you did enjoy it. Comment down below, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.